What's up guys, it's Chase Grant from Grow Landscaping here and I'm gonna give you three big mistakes people make when starting their lawn care and landscape business. If that interests you, stay tuned for this video. Okay, so you're starting your lawn care business. You don't really know how to start, but you're just trying to do something. You ask someone to use their mower, they're asking maybe your dad, your mom, your, maybe your grandma for a mower, if you can borrow it, go knock on some doors of your neighbors and start mowing some yards around your neighborhood. You're just going through the motions, you're doing it slow pace, just like the only way you can start, right? You don't have money, you don't have anything, you just have to go by what you have. But number one big mistake that people don't make as soon as it hits day one is you have to come up with a plan. If you don't have a plan, there's no direction the business is going. There's no jobs you may do, may not do. This is what you need to do. You have to sit down and think, do I want to do lawn care, landscape? Do I want to do hardscaping? Is tree work going to be what I do? Am I going to do bed redesigns, clean outs, mulch installations? You got to come up with exactly the plan of how you want to do, how big you want to scale the business, because that's going to be a big decider of like say price and how you carry yourself around your business. A plan is the one most important thing in your business when you're starting a lawn care business. And if you don't have one, trust me, it won't last long. Okay, so number two. This one's a little bit less important of the first one, but it's almost equally as important as you scale your business. When you're doing a lawn care, when you're starting a lawn care business, one thing you need to really focus on is branding, how your advertisements look, how your flyers, door hangers, how your maybe your car magnets or magnets that you're putting on your truck, car, truck, however you gotta start, you gotta start. But as long as your branding is right, branding is a key step in scaling your lawn care business. It doesn't matter if you have a car or how you're starting. If someone's looking at a flyer, they can't see you. If your flyer looks professional and looks better than every other person's flyers in your, in your area that you're competing against, trust me, you'll end up on top, regardless of how big or small any other company is. Branding is one of the most important things. If you didn't know, I actually started in a Ford Fusion. Actually, here's a picture. I started in a Ford Fusion, and I had, I mean, you looked at it, it was beat, man. The court was beat. I had my push mower in the trunk. I had, I had nothing. I mean, I was just starting out. I'm starting a lawn care business. I didn't have any money. But when people saw my advertisements, here's the picture. I don't need another, but I'll take it. Uh, those are my old advertisements that I used to have. I have a lot more effective advertisements. They weren't that effective. But they look professional enough to the point where people didn't expect that that was gonna be me pulling up. So when I basically, when they saw my advertisements, they called, got, I got them on schedule. A lot of times when I pulled up, they were surprised. But then they see the work, they see his quality work, and then they don't really care. But if that's how they're seeing you, or if you're, talk, if you're coming, talking about people walking up to you, it doesn't happen a lot, especially when you're starting out when you're just, you know, push mowing in a car and you have zero branding, you want branding on your flyers, on your advertisement that people, they're not seeing you, they're just seeing your brand. That's all they're gonna see and it will play a key role in growing your lawn care business and getting it to the place you wanna be, whether small, big, one crew, five crews, doesn't matter. Branding is important in scaling your lawn care business and to make your business as efficient as possible. The third biggest mistake in starting your lawn care business is relying on referrals. Referrals are not guaranteed. They're basically, referrals is just a sense of hope. You're, you hoping that your customers like your service enough that they're gonna go out and tell everyone about it. What, what if they're just not talking to people? You see, now you're just hoping that you have the type of customer that may be outgoing, may be willing to talk to other people, may be pushing, your business on everyone. That doesn't happen a lot. You're, you're basically hoping that your customers are extroverts. 
if you want to force your way into the market, regardless of luck or not, and make this not a luck game, but a game of numbers, you gotta get advertisement, door hangers, postcards, you need direct mailers, you need online advertising, you need advertising on Facebook, maybe start a Google page, maybe start get on Yelp. You gotta, you gotta get your name out there. Referrals, yes. They're great. Those are sometimes the best customers because they already know your service is good because people already told you. But don't rely on that as your main source of advertisement. It's just not, it's just complete luck. It's not consistent. And you will never scale a business based only on referrals. You may, if you're lucky, I force my way in the market when you're using advertisement, you can get your numbers like, oh, I know I can have 2% of people call me from each advertisement. So I put out 2,000, I'll have 20 people call me, and then maybe I'll close five. You see what I'm saying? You know how much you can get. You know how many leads you can get. It's not a false sense of hope. It's not hope. It's numbers. If you want to scale a business, you got to make this a numbers game not a luck game. A luck game, you may win, you may lose, it's gambling. And personally, I'm not a gambler. I don't like to gamble. Unless it's somewhere, somehow that I know I'm making money, I'm good. I'm, I'll stay free of gambling. I can gamble on myself. And myself and my advertisements have gotten me to the place I am today. Hey, my name is Chase Grant. I'm a girl landscaping and I hope you guys Enjoy this and I hope you guys can benefit from these three big tips that I'm giving you guys. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh, you guys see that in the background? Don't look too much. I know, I know, I know. That's for the next video. Tune into my Instagram if you wanted to know what that was. But if you weren't on my Instagram, you won't know until the next video. It's coming. Peace.